Alright, so this is the start of part two. We're on the bridge area. Got her pretty close to the channel. That dropped pretty good. Just the wind caught it, so I gotta make the line tight. And then I can loosen the drag. I can leave this one farther out because it's a heavier pull. I don't have to worry about it flying over. This other one's a lot lighter. I'm gonna put some bait on it and then I'll throw it up. Alright, we're gonna cast out the Marathon Ice Centennial. There's like a little channel that goes through here out to the deeper water out there. So the tide's gonna start to go out now, so the fish will start to come through here. I'm just gonna try to drop it. Like, so there's the shore, obviously. And then I'm gonna try to drop it like in the middle because it runs like that. So I try to drop it in there. Yep, I'm like right in there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's like two lines too. Get right in the middle. Just gotta tighten this up. Loosen the drag. I gotta keep this one closer because it's a lighter pull. Okay. There we go. Yeah, we don't need the net. Okay, so we're gonna reel our stuff in, and then we're gonna go to the other side of the bridge. It's blocked by the wind. The blocked by the bridge. The wind is. So we want to worry about all this cold wind hitting us in the face. So we're just gonna reel them in. Alrighty. Nothing wrong with this spot, it's just, it's not even hitting. We're not getting any bites today, so I don't wanna just sit here and freeze my cooler off. So I'm going to bring just this pole out there to the other side. Just make this the same video. Okay, so the first one was on the other side. That was part one. So yeah, we got this up. And the tide's still going out, so... When we're on that side, we're hoping that... I'll show you guys when we get over there, but... The tide's still coming out, so they'll go right through us. Alright, catch you guys when I get on the other side. I don't know if you guys could hear that. I just played a bike bagpipe over there. Yeah, go on. yeah, I don't know if you guys can hear it, probably not, but it's a bagpipe dude. When we go down there, you probably the audio will probably be better. But you just can't see him. Yeah. Let's go down. It's all good. We're here to fish. That's cool though. <laughs> Almost tripped. Let's go over here. Off road and chunk class. No wind. No wind right here. And it's all deep right here. Yeah. This one was. That's where we hold the poles. Yeah. But that one now. Huh. Alright. Let's get out there. I'm going to go straight out here. To the left is the, the wall. I'm doing that snagged up. Towards the middle. And then, right in that channel. And then with this spot, at least for me. So, I'll loosen up the drag. And I got a pole holder. Alright, hopefully get a bite.
I don't know if you guys can hear that. There's a bagpipe going off. <laughs> bagpipe going off. It's just the guy playing the bagpipe. Yeah, it's a good place to sit. <laughs> yeah, you can sleep over there if you wanted. But here's our setup. Got our squid table right there. My line's out there, towards the middle. And my dad's is about right there. Alright, we're gonna wrap this one up. Got skunked out here today. Just gonna reel our, our baits in. And then we'll close the video up at the car. All right, that's gonna wrap up this uh, two-part video. See how we fished uh, this little spot on the left side, or I guess the right side, if you're coming in. But yeah, I didn't get anything, no bites or anything, so we're gonna make another video uh, next Sunday. We're gonna go to um, Albany Bowl. It's in Berkeley. Yeah, we used to catch a lot of sharks and stingers and stuff out there. See, that'll be the first time on these videos that I've been out there. See if you guys like this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends so they can watch it. And we'll see you in the next one.